Hello everyone, please welcome and join me this Steps Cooking. Today I'm going to share with you one of the quick and easy recipe. It's very tasty and super delicious. I'm going to use the chicken thighs and I'm going to do pan fry. And when I'm going to do the pan fry, I'm going to use the baby creamer, the classic baby creamer potatoes. What I have done, I put it in a bowl, wash with the cold water. They are nice. You can keep it as is but I'm going to cut in half. I'm going to use the spices and I'm going to use it for my spice rack. So please check it out the description below. I'm going to use one teaspoon grinder powder, one teaspoon cumin powder, salt to taste, but I'm using one teaspoon. One teaspoon black pepper, ground ginger, half teaspoon. Turmeric powder, half teaspoon. I'll use two teaspoon deggy milk. I'm going to mix it well. Once all the spices are mixed, I will bring. So we're going to make sure that it's nicely coated. Chicken thighs. As the chicken thighs, it's the fresh meat and uh, these are skinless and boneless. So we're going to mix it well. You can use your hand. It's a personal choice or you can use a fork just like the way I'm doing it. All the spices are nicely incorporated and we're going to let it sit for 10 minutes on countertop. We marinated our chicken thigh. We're going to wait for 10 minutes. Classic baby creamers, potatoes, and I'm going to cut it in half and I'm going to place it in the bowl. So I'm going to finish all of these. All the potatoes are cut in half. What I'm going to do, I'll bring olive oil and I will use like a one teaspoon. Black pepper, half teaspoon. Salt, I'm going to use very little, like a quarter teaspoon. I'm going to use kasuri methi, like one teaspoon. You always can use oregano, basil, rosemary, whatever you like. Just make sure that everything is mixed well. And that's it. These baby creamers, they are really delicious. Please try it if you haven't tried it. I'm going to get a big fry pan because I'm going to pan fry the chicken and my baby creamer potatoes. I'm going to start the gas. I'll start the fan. I'll bring olive oil about one tablespoon. You can use any vegetable oil, whatever you like. So I'm going to make sure that my pan is coated nicely at the bottom. As the oil started to heat up, I'm going to bring the chicken. I'm going to lay out my chicken. All the chicken thighs. We're going to cook our chicken five minutes on one side, then I'm going to flip it over. Cooking our chicken for five minutes on a high gas, and I'm going to turn the chicken over. It's looking so good. And now I'm going to bring all the baby potatoes in there at the same time. And I'll bring the gas to medium. I'm going to spread it evenly and we're going to cover with the lid. Chicken is cooked, five minutes. Now we have our baby creamer potatoes. They are laid out evenly and we keep the gas on medium. And we're going to cook it for 10 minutes. Cooking our chicken along with our baby creamers for 10 minutes on medium flame. I'm going to turn my fan on and I'm going to open the lid. And we can bring the chicken on top of it now. The slow cooking always brings the taste. So we make sure that all the potatoes underneath, the chicken is on the top. After placing our chicken on top of uh, the potatoes, 
We're going to cover with the lid again and we're going to cook at five minutes. Cooking chicken with potatoes for additional five minutes. So I'm going to check the chicken if it's fully cooked or not. If we look, the chicken is nicely cooked. If I check this piece. Yes, it's nicely cooked. Our gas is still on medium. And I'm going to make sure that I turn over the potatoes. And we'll bring the chicken on the side. Our potatoes also cook. If we look at this one, it's nicely done. And they start sticking at the bottom. So just to get the turner or scraper and we're just going to scrape over potatoes this is all done so I'm going to dish out it's so delicious I'm really hungry all that chicken all the flavors all the potatoes look at this the dish is all ready and I'm going to share with you. The pan fried chicken with baby potatoes is all ready and it's tasty and super delicious. Please try it. It's quick and easy to make and I hope you like it. If you like it, like always, please like, share and subscribe Easy Steps Cooking. Thank you. Bye-bye.